This is our street. It's where we live. We love to play together. Topsy! Just like you. Just like us. Hey, and Kim. we'll be friends forever. We can be anything. Street, it's where we live, so let's all play together. Be <laughs> best friends forever. It's us, Topsy and Tim. <laughs> it's raining in our house. Come and see. <laughs> Rainy house. Quickly, Topsy! Coming as fast as I can! <sighs> Here comes another drip, Tim! Quick! Put the ball under us! We've got a hole in our roof and the rain is dripping through our bedroom ceiling. Onto our bunk bed! Got you! Well done, Tim. OK, leave the bowl up there and come down with me. Oh. Ready? Come on, Tim. One, two, three. Yeah. Way. There we go. You too, Topsy. Lovely. One, One two, three. Way. Thank you. Now, can you two please help me take off these pillowcases? Okay. Why is there a hole in our roof, Mummy? Well, Dad thinks the tile's come loose, so he's coming home to fix it. I'll help him. Oh, he'd like that. Where right. am I going to sleep tonight, Mummy? Up here on the top bunk, as usual, Topsy. Dad will fix the roof and I will wash and dry your sheets. Oh, and little Moon Bunny, of course. Little Moon Bunny! <coughs> little Moon Bunny's my favourite cuddly toy of all. And now he's all wet. Can you help me dry little Moon Bunny, please, Mummy? No, Topsy. I think we need to wash little Moon Bunny. Why? Well, water that comes through the roof can be dirty. Please, will you help me put him in the washing machine? Yes, yeah, you can have a nice ride. <laughs> Come on. After you. Good girl. So Little Moon Bunny's having his wash. Hello, Little Moon Bunny. When the doorbell rings. Oh, Topsy, should we get the door? I'm staying here with Little Moon Bunny. our best friend. She lives three houses away. Her mummy's dropping her off for a play date. Yay, Kerry! Come on up and see the rain that's coming in. Bye, lovely! Bye! <laughs> <laughs> Where are you, Tim? I'm up here on the top bunk. Hi, Tim. Hi, Kerry. <gasps> wow, is that rain coming through your ceiling? Yeah, I'm catching the raindrops so Topsy's bunk bed doesn't get any wetter. Here comes another one. I'm ready for it. Got you! <laughs> Where's Topsy? She's downstairs. Little Moon Bunny is in the washing machine. He got rained on and now he's wet. OK, then I'll go and see her. OK. Little moon bunny. He looks all funny. Yeah. <laughs> he smells nice and clean, Topsy, though. Yes, he really does. Come on, Kerry, let's put little moon bunny on the windowsill to dry. Okay. Let's put him here, Kerry. He's here! 
Hello, gang! <laughs> what a lot of rain! <laughs> Hello. Where's this leak then? Hi, Dad. Come upstairs and I'll show you. Come in, Tim! Oh. Look, rainwater is dripping into this bottle. I put it there myself. Ah, well done, Tim. Now, let's have a look out here. Can you see it, Dad? Can you see the hole in that roof? I can't see anything. Why? Because I need to go high up to the roof from outside. We need a long ladder. But we haven't got a long ladder. No, but we know a man who does. <laughs> <laughs> Dad phones Kerry's dad, Carson. Carson is a fireman. He works at Hatcham Fire Station. Look, it's Carson and his long ladder. It's a really long ladder. Hi, Daddy. Hey, Kerry. The rain stops at last, everybody. Yeah! Carson? Yeah? We've got a hole in our roof and water's dripping through it. Little Moon Bunny got rained on in our bedroom. Well, it's just as well I came round to help. Yeah! <laughs> Carson's long ladder reaches right up to the roof of our house. And now it's raining again. Hello in there. Hello, Dad. <laughs> Keep an eye on those drips, Tim. Tell me if they stop, please. OK, Dad. I can see the tile that slipped. Dad can see the tile that slipped, Carson. Can you fix it? Can you fix it, Dad? I don't know. I'm just trying to reach it. Still dripping, Dad. OK, just a minute. Yep, all done. The tile had just slipped down a bit. I put it back into place with a nail. Look, Dad, the drips are stopping. Okay. Hooray! We fixed it, Carson. Hooray! Did I hear a cheer? Yes, we fixed the roof, Mummy. Hey, well done, Tim. Thank you for all of your help. <laughs> How's this a moon bunny, Mummy? He's lovely and dry and cuddling with Topsy. <laughs> well done. By bedtime, little moon bunny and my bunk bed were dry and everything was back to normal. It's still raining outside. Oh, I know, what a day. But you and little moon bunny are warm and dry and cuddly. <laughs> <laughs> but then... Mummy, Daddy! Now there's rain coming through a bathroom ceiling. Oh, no. There must be another hole in our roof. I know what we all should do. We all need to move to a different house. What did you say, Topsy? Oh, nothing. And that's when Mummy said... Would, Would you, you like, like to move from this house to a, to a different house? house? Would you like to move from this house to a different house, Topsy? No, I didn't really mean this about a different house, Mummy. No, this is our house. Well, it's something to think about. I love our house. Good. So, let's have a proper look at this bathroom trip. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> And that, said Dad, was that. Hey. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> 
one of my cuddly toys was washed today. Can you remember which toy was washed? Was it a cuddly dog? Or was it a cuddly bunny? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is a cuddly bunny. Cool little moon bunny. Great game. That was good fun. See you soon. We can play. Strange beds. <laughs> Hello, Derek. Oh. Hello, oh. Derek. It's you two again. Timsy and Top. <laughs> Timsy and Top, we're Topsy and Tim. Oh, yes, silly me. How could I forget? Topsy and Tim. No, no, the other way round. Oh, the other way round? You mean Topsy and Tim, that way round? Do you mean? <laughs> no. That's not what you meant, was it? No. Now, I've been painting the ceiling. Can you see that? I've got it on me right Water was dripping through our bedroom ceiling from the roof. Dad fixed the roof, but DIY Derek is painting over where the leak was inside. Can we help, Derek? Please? Please? Of course you can. It's my home time, so you two can help me a tidy up. OK. OK, one of you hold my roller while I wipe my hands. Me, me, me! There you are then, Tim. You hold that. <laughs> right. Thanks, Tim. Now, I'll show you where to put it so we don't get a mess everywhere, OK? It goes in our there. bedroom doesn't look like our bedroom today. Now then, what do you think, Topsy? Our bedroom looks funny, Derek. Ah, yes, it's cos I've covered it all in dust sheets so I don't get paint everywhere, you see? You see? Right, Tim, can you help me put the lid on the paint here? Right, push it down as hard as you can. There you go. Oh, that's good. Well done. Thank you. Right. Tim, under here. Where? In my den. <laughs> Done, Derek. Oh, hi, Joy. No, I'm afraid I'm going to have to come back in the morning and give the ceiling another coat of paint. Oh, so the twins can't sleep in here tonight, then? No. I'm going to have to leave it like this till the paint dries. If we go and sleep in our bedroom tonight, where are we going to sleep, Topsy? I don't like them. Right, that's me. I'm done. Oh. See you tomorrow, Joy. Bye. Thanks, Bye. Derek. Mummy? Oh, hello. If we can't sleep in our bedroom tonight, where are we going to sleep? Well, we haven't got a spare room, so we're going to have to think about something else. But don't worry, I've got an idea. So have I. Oh. <laughs> we can sleep in Mummy and Dad's bed, Tim. <laughs> boing, 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 boing. Hello, everyone. Bye, Bye Dad. Dad. I saw Derek on his way out. Boing. Did he tell you he hasn't finished painting the twins' bedroom? Yeah. Yeah, so we're sleeping in your bed tonight, Dad. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, you're not. Come out of there, please. Oh. Come on, you two. Oh. You are far too big to squeeze in with us. <laughs> <laughs> you snore anyway. <gasps> like this. <laughs> you cheeky monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> but where are we going to sleep tonight, Dad? I know, I know! Living in the bar tonight, Mummy. <laughs> you comfy? No. No. <laughs> well, then you can't sleep in here tonight, can you? You need comfy beds for a good night's sleep. So tonight, we're having a special camping holiday. Where? Where? <sighs> You'll find out. But first, who's for an early bath? Me! Yay! Me! Me! Come on, then. Ah. Hey. Ah. <laughs> tells us that our special camping holiday will be downstairs. Tonight, Topsy and I will sleep on the living room floor and blow up camp beds. Oh. I think it's blown up enough now, Dad. Oh, thanks, Tim. Oh. Blowing up beds is hard work. I'm ready for bed myself. Dad! Mm. Dad! Mm. Wake up, Dad! Mm. We still have Topsy's bed to do. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I'm a 
almost there. This is taking ages. Hey, Tim. I'll do this. Catch, Tim. <laughs> <laughs> to do things differently when you're on holiday. Go on, good boy. <laughs> Go on, get him. Go on, get him. Ah! 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 <laughs> and so we got ready to sleep in the living room. <laughs> Come on, twins, into bed. Our bedtime stories. Of course you will. I'll tell her when you're ready. 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 Mm. <laughs> Sleep well. being quiet and pretending to be asleep when we heard Mummy say, I want us to move to a bigger house. I want us to move to a bigger house, Bri. One with a proper spare bedroom. Not camp beds on the living room floor. I think you're right. It's time to move house. I like our house. I don't want to move house. <laughs> Topsy and Tim, don't worry about moving house now. It's time for stories. Yay! Would you like your night light? Yes, please. Yes, please. No more talk of a house move tonight, OK? OK. OK. Look at you two all snugly in your cosy camp beds. <laughs> oh, it's just like your bedroom now, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. It has. <laughs> Which story would you like first? This one, please. This one? This one. And then this one. <laughs> <laughs> OK, Twintastic Tim and Twintabulous Topsy. And that, said Mummy, was that. Hello. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Today, we pretended to be duvet monsters. But can you remember who we chased? Was it Mummy? Or was it Dad? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is Dad. Watch this. And I put your books, twins. Thank you. Rawr! 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 A duvet monster now! <laughs> no, 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 get back. Game. That 
most good fun. See you soon. <laughs> Double play date. We love to invite friends to our house to play. <laughs> Mummy makes cakes and we think of fun things to do. Is my quad bike working, Mummy? Well, it's been charging all night, Tim, so the battery should be full. Why don't you take it outside and try it? Oh, yay. My friend Tony Welch is coming today. We're going to play on my quad bike in the garden. And my friend Binder and I are going to decorate cakes. It's working, Mummy! Oh, good! Would you like to try one of the cakes now that they've cooled, Topsy? Yes, please, Mummy. They smell very nice. They really do. Mummy's got a baby in her tummy, but she doesn't know if it's a boy or a girl. I think it's a baby girl. Tony hopes it's a baby boy. I'm going to find out today at the hospital. I'll be back about five. Is that okay, Joy? Yes, no problem. I'll see you later, Elaine. Bye. Bye, <laughs> Bye Elaine. When is Finder going to be here, Mummy? Oh, soon, Topsy. I know. Why don't we make the cake icing together now so that it's ready for when Vinda arrives? Yes? Yes! <laughs> Hands wash first, please. Okay. Super wash! While we wait for Vinda, Mummy shows me how to make icing. Yummy! <laughs> Perfect. Keep stirring. You're doing such a good job. Tim! Tim! Fun, fun, fun! Oh, Mummy, where is Vinda? Oh, I'm sure Vinda will be here any minute. Come on, let's ice these cakes before the icing goes hard. Tony, my turn now. Please, can I just have one more go? <laughs> Okay, Topsy, if you come and sit here for me. Good girl. And then once you've iced the cake, you can then put the chocolate sprinkles on. So I'll hold this and you sprinkle that over the top for me. Brilliant. Really shake it. Brilliant. Perfect. Okay, that's enough. Look, Mummy, V for Vinda. That's a lovely V, Topsy. <laughs> Tim, look at the cake I made for Vinda. Oh, yeah. Can I decorate a cake too, Mummy? Oh, no, Tim. These are just for Vinda and Topsy to decorate. Why aren't you playing in the garden with Tony? I'm letting Tony have another go. Vinda! <laughs> Hi there, Vinda. Hi, Vinda. Hi. Oh, sorry. Bikes took us ages. Oh, don't worry. Go on through, Hi, girls. Jackie. We're making cakes. I made one for you. Come and see. Hi, Tim. Hi, Vinda. Look at the cake I made for you, Vinda. Look, that for Vinda. Thank you. Mm. We're going to have this one. <laughs> I'm going to take this one. You're going to decorate them. Come on, girls. Mm. Here you go. Tony, my turn now. Okay, I'll drive it to you. <laughs> it's not working. Tim, Tim. No, Mummy. They haven't even had a go on the quad bike yet, and it's broken. Oh, Tim, it's not broken. 
broken. It just needs charging. Oh, Tony. Ages. Oh, just be patient. If Tony brings it here, we can charge it up. Binder. Yeah. That looks like a princess cake. I know because it's for my mum. Really? Yeah. I know. Why don't we show our cakes to the boys? Okay. Come on. That's really good. Tony, you can give that cake to your mummy, Vinda. I didn't even get one go on my quad bike. I think I want to go home now, Mrs O'Dell. What time is my mum coming, please? Sorry, Tim. Well, if you stay, you can have pizza. Pizza! Yes, please! Pizza made everyone happy again. Who wants the last piece of pizza? Me! Yes! Oh, it's okay. You can have it. We can share it? Oh, yeah, that'll be great. Good idea. Yeah. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. And as we were finishing our tea, the doorbell went again. It was Tony and Vinda's mums. Look who's here. It's home time. Hi, Tony. Oh, Hi. We wanted to stay a bit longer. <laughs> hey, I've got some news. Ooh. Especially for you, Tony. The baby in my tummy is a boy. You're going to have a baby brother. Oh, and he can play with all my toys. And when he arrives, you can bring him here for a play date. <laughs> <laughs> but that's when Tony said, But my mum says you're selling this house. But my mum says you're selling this house, Topsy and Tim. So we can't come here for a play date again, can we? Isn't that right, Mummy? Well, Tony, I said it was something that we were thinking about doing. But we don't want to sell our house. Where will we live? In another house. And we won't move far from here so that you can still see your friends Tony and Vinda whenever you like. I promise. Yeah! And that, said Mummy, was that. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> today, we had a double play date with our friends, Tony Welch and Vinda. Can you remember who bumped into the cakes? Was it Topsy? Or was it Tony? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is Tony. Watch this. like a princess cake. I know, because it's for my mum. Really? Yeah. I know. Why don't we show our cakes to the boys? OK. Come on. That's really good. Fun. See you soon. <laughs> New clothes. It's Mossy! Hello, Mossy! Whenever Mossy
see the dog arrive, Grandma is always close behind. Hello. Hello, Grandma. Hello, Hello lovelies. <laughs> Your hair looks different, Grandma. Yes. Do you like the red? It took the hairdresser all morning to colour it. <laughs> I think you look pretty. Oh. Mummy, can I have red hair like Grandma? <laughs> no, I don't think so, Topsy. Oh. Where's my Hello, Grandma Huggle? Squeeze! Who wants to help me unpack the shopping? Me! me. I, I do! do. Now I've got what did you get? We love seeing what Mummy's bought at the shops. What's in the bag? <laughs> Show you, you two are both getting bigger yes. and you're growing out of the clothes that you're already wearing. So, Topsy, for you, <gasps> new big girl jeans. Wow, they've got butterflies on them. Look, Dad, <laughs> look, Tim. <gasps> well done, Mummy. <laughs> and for you, Tim, I got these. What do you think? I just want new clothes. Come and have a look. Look, these ones have got a dinosaur on them. Are they a good choice? What do you say? Thank you, Mummy. Good boy. Thank you, Mummy. I love my new jeans. Oh, Grandma, no. Grandma, look at my new jeans. Look, Grandma, I've got butterflies on my new jeans. May I try them on now, please, Mummy? Yeah, of course you can, Topsy. Tim, do you want to try your new dinosaur jeans on now? No. Mossy needs a biscuit. Good girl. No more. No. <laughs> you don't need any more, see? Well done, Tim. Now, no double wash your hands, please. <laughs> What's that? It's a special chart designed to show how tall you are compared to different animals. Be as tall as a dinosaur. <laughs> okay, well, dry your hands and we can see how tall you are. Like a brachiosaurus. Come on. Hi, Chart. Come on. And stand against the wall for me. Stand up straight. Perfect. All right, let's see how tall you are and step away. Look, you are a cheetah. As tall as a cheetah from nose to tail. <gasps> Rawr. Rawr. Fastest land animal in the world, apparently. Wow. How fast can you run? Rah! Stay Tim. Goodbye, Grandma Huggle, please. I've got a bus to catch. Come on, Mossy. Time to go. <laughs> Good girl. There we go. Lead on. Bye bye, Mossy. Oh, bye bye, Mossy. Got her now. That's it. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye, Mossy. Bye, Grandma. Bye. Bye-bye. Topsy, bye -bye. can you carry that up to the bathroom for me, please? Oh. OK, Mummy. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> bye, Jean. Bye, love. Go, I'll see you in your dinosaur jeans yeah. next time I pop over to. Bye. <laughs> Out. I've measured myself and I'm as tall as a gorilla. <laughs> and this gorilla likes cheetahs so much he gobbles them. Try your new jeans on for me, please. Just to see if they fit. Oh, Mummy! I don't want to. I like what I've got on. Oh, <laughs> darling, you and Topsy, you're getting bigger. And your clothes don't fit you anymore. You need new clothes. Oh, look. Do you remember these? Our old, old T-shirts. <laughs> Grandma bought them for your second birthday. Look how tiny they are. 
Oh, and look at these. Your little dungarees with holes in the knees. Red for... Tulsi and blue for me. Hey. That's right. You used to wear these all the time. I can't believe they ever fitted you, my big boy Tim. You know what? We need to get rid of some old clothes to make room for your new clothes. Topsy so can help me find some bags. <laughs> Why have we always had matching twin clothes? And today, you've bought us different clothes. Because you and Topsy are getting bigger. You're growing up. And you like different things now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like dinosaurs. That's why you bought me dinosaur jeans. That is exactly right. And I got Topsy sparkly butterflies on her jeans. Because she likes butterflies. <laughs> exactly that. <laughs> Kem! Kem! Look at me, Kem! I'm wearing my old trousers as wings. Oh. <laughs> I've got them. I'm a golden eagle. Dad measured me on the animal height charts. I can fly! <laughs> fly! Yes, please try on your new jeans, Tim. So I put on my new dinosaur jeans and, guess what? I really like them. <gasps> you look all grown up, son. <laughs> What's for lunch? Spaghetti bolognese. Those new dinosaur jeans fit you really nicely, Tim. Thank you. <laughs> look at us. We're wearing different jeans. We're not twins anymore, Mummy. Oh, yeah. Of course you are. You'll always be twins. You're my twins. You are twin-tastic Topsy and twin-tabulous Tim. <laughs> you're just growing up, that's all. And I think your bedroom isn't big enough for two growing <laughs> twins and all their big clothes anymore, is it? It's not big enough. And that's when Mummy said, if we move house, you, you can each have a bedroom of your own. If we move to a bigger house, you can each have a bedroom of your own. What do you think about that? <laughs> would I be able to have butterfly wallpaper to match my jeans? <laughs> yes, of course you would. Well, that's sorted. Now, double wash your hands. It's time for lunch. <laughs> <laughs> and that's it, Mummy. What was that? <laughs> Into a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Today, Mummy came back with some new clothes. But can you remember what clothes she bought us? Were they new shorts? Or were they new jeans? The answer is behind the clouds. Look, the answer is new jeans. Watch this. What's for lunch? Spaghetti bolognese. Those new dinosaur jeans fit you really nicely, Tim. Thank you. <laughs> Look at us. We're wearing different jeans. We're not twins anymore, Mummy. Oh, yeah. Of course you are. You'll always be twins. You're my twins. You are twin-tastic Topsy and twin-tabulous <laughs> Tim. <laughs> You're just growing up, that's all. And I think your bedroom isn't big enough for two growing <laughs> twins. And all their big clothes anymore, is it? It's not big enough. Great game. That was good fun. See you soon. <laughs> Lost keys. We'll be going in a minute, Mossy. Okay. Sometimes, Grandma looks after us when Mummy's at a meeting. Then, when Dad's back from work, we drive to Grandma's house for tea. <sighs> hey, Mossy. 
Saucy dog, you hungry buns girl. Oh. <sighs> Where's that daddy of yours? He knows Mossy needs feeding. I'll go and get him, Grandma. Lovely. Dad will get you home for your tea soon, Mossy. Oh. It's OK. Only you live nearer to me. We can walk <laughs> over tea. Here you come, Topsy. Thank you, Grandma. Go okay. long. Okay. Dad! Sorry, but we can't go. Grandma says Mossy needs her tea. Yeah, but I need to find my house keys first. They could be in here. Oh, Dad, look. There are some keys. Look at these old keys. No, none of these keys are my keys. My keys a two house keys together on a key ring. But thank you, Topsy. Oh, look, it's my swirly whirly straw. I thought I'd lost that. Oh, good. Put it on top for later, please. We're in a rush. OK. I can't lock the front door until I find my house keys. Oh, you help me? OK, I'll help you. Thanks, Topsy. Dad, you're always losing your keys. Hmm. Dad, have you tried looking in the coat pockets like last time? Oh, yes, good idea. Let's go. <laughs> Long now, Mossy. Where are these keys? Maybe they've fallen out the coat pocket and into the wellies. Okay. Side table. I'll be with you in a minute, Grandma and Tim. What did you say, Brian? Why is your dad taking so long? Shall I go and find out for you, Grandma? Oh, yes, please, Tim. Get you out. Oh, sorry, Mossy. Dad! Dad! Topsy! Grandma wants to know why you're taking ages. OK. Ah. Dad's lost his house keys. That means he can't lock the door when we leave. Dad, you're always losing your house keys. I know. Could you help me find them? Yes. Good boy. I know where your keys would be. Where? Here. You always find stuff down the back of the sofa. Oh, yeah. Didn't Miss Maple say that at nursery school? Yes! Miss Maple found a gold ring in her sofa. It could be in here. Anything, Tim? No. <gasps> Dad, look! The TV remote! It was down the back of the sofa all this time. Thank you, Topsy. But I need to find my house keys first. Dad. That's good. Meow, meow, meow. Keys? Tim, did you find my house keys? Oh, no, sorry, Dad, no keys. <sighs> Topsy? Meow, meow. Telly off, please, Topsy. Topsy? Tim! Where is everyone? <laughs> Mossy. Oh, let's see what's keeping them all. Sorry, 
you, Grandma. Dad's lost his house key. Oh, not again. Poor Mossy's hungry. <coughs> Tim, take Mossy, please. Oh, OK. We could have walked home by Mossy. now. Mossy, poor doggy. Mossy! I found your ball. <coughs> Catch! Yay! Yeah. Spit it out! Spit it out, Mossy. Leave Spit. it! Leave it! Leave it! Good girl! Catch! <coughs> And that's when I saw something. <laughs> something really funny. Tim, look! <laughs> it's Dad's keys. Dad, we found them. We found your keys. Great, let's go. Your house keys. Where were they? Well, I was trying to get the ball mm -hmm. when it bounced inside. When I had to look behind the door, and there they were in the front door. The keys were hanging there all the time. Silly me, that's where I left them. <laughs> Dad! Oh, sorry. Thank you. <laughs> Topsy <laughs> and Tim for finding my keys. Let's go. Please. Yeah. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Come on, let's go. <laughs> so we all got back in the car and Grandma told Dad off in a funny way. You will always be my silly billy boy, Brian. <laughs> Your keys are in the door all the time. If you didn't live this side of town, we, we could, could have walked, walked home, home by, by now. now. <laughs> and that's when Dad said... When, when we, we sell, sell our house... When we sell our house, Topsy and Tim, I suppose we could buy somewhere nearer to Grandma. I don't want to sell our house. I do. I want to buy a new house closer to Grandma, and then we can see Mossy whenever we like. Where is Mossy? Mossy! We forgot a Mossy! Oh! I'll go and get her. <sighs> Mossy! Sorry, Mossy! <laughs> Sorry, Mossy. And that's your dad was that. <laughs> his house keys. But can you remember where we found his keys? Were they under the sofa? Or were they in the front door? The answer is behind the cloud. The answer is the keys were in the front door. Watch this. Catch! Yay! Spit it out, Mossy. Leave it. Leave it. Leave it. Good girl. Catch. <laughs> oh, and that's when I saw something. <laughs> something really funny. <gasps> Tim, look. <laughs> it's Dad's keys. <laughs> Dad, we found them. We found your keys. Great game. Good fun. See you soon. <laughs> Dog day. <laughs> when we look after Grandma's dog, Mossy, we feed her and play with her and take her for walks. Here you go, Mossy. A nice drink for you. Oh, Mossy, look, Mossy. Always superwash your hands, please, Tim, after touching Mossy's bowl. OK. Soon it'll be time for your walk, won't it, Mossy? Let's go and find your bowl. Come on, Mossy. Come on. I'll get it. That'll be Tony. Here 
Wait for me, Tim, before you open the front door. Catch! Love me! Mummy, it's just Tony Welch. OK, Tim, you can open the door for Tony. Hello! Hello. Tony's mummy has to go to the doctor's. So Tony is staying to play. Come back about five ish, is that OK? Great. See you later. Again. Show me! Mussy! 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 Push it! Wow! 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 Clever girl, Mussy! I love you, Mussy! She's so clever! Let's give Mussy a nice treat for yes. being such a clever girl. I think she deserves one. Yes. Wait for me! See a treat, please. Yes, go ahead. She's I been a good dog. Uh, yep, they're down there, good girl. Oh. Mossy knows where they are. Ask Mossy if she wants a treat. Do you want a treat, Mossy? Yes? No. Sit. Sit, Mossy. Sit. Take. Can I give Mossy a doggy treat? No, sorry, you can't, Tony. You see, Grandma says that she can only have one treat at a time. No more, no more, all gone. <laughs> well done, Tim. Now, can you double super wash your hands for me, please? Okay. I'm going to go and wash my hands upstairs, Mummy. Okay. Come on, Mossy. Good girl. Is it time to take Mossy out for her walk now, Mummy? Yes, it is. Can I hold Mossy's lead today, please, Mrs O'Dell? Yes, you can take it in turns to hold the lead. Now, let's get ready to go out. Come on. Good girl, Mossy. Stay. Sometimes, when Mossy's a little bit naughty... Oh, Mossy, Mossy, you little scamp! We know it's definitely time for her walk. I'm going to have to throw this toilet roll away now. <coughs> Hurry up, please, Topsy, before Mossy does anything else silly. OK, Mummy! <laughs> oh, oh, Mossy, you need a walk. Mossy, no pulling. Hurry up, Topsy. I think Mossy needs a wee. Now, Tim, remember, keep your finger on that button to stop Mossy's lead getting any longer so she can't go any further away, OK? OK. Let's get her to her favourite bit of hedge, quickly. Yeah. Topsy! I'm trying to find Mossy's ball. Yeah, Topsy, I think the ball's underneath the sofa. Thanks, Mummy. Now, Tim, have you remembered the poo bags that Grandma Jean brought round? Oh, no. Sorry, I'll get them. OK. Can I hold Mossy's lead, please? Oh, yes, you can. Hold that for me. I'll just get the phone. I'll be back in a moment. Look after Mossy. Uh -huh. This is a great lead, Mossy. Hello? Oh, Jean, yes. Yeah, no, Mossy's fine. Uh -huh. We're just about to take her for her afternoon walk. We'll see you later. OK, bye. Got it. Was that Grandma, Mummy? Yes, it was, just to remind us about Mossy's walk. Come on, let's get going. I found the poo bags. Could someone help me 
Where's Mossy's lead, please? Come in, Daddy. Where's Mossy? <gasps> She's on Mr. and Mrs. Fishwick's lawn. No, no Mossy, no. Um, Mummy, I think Mossy's done something on Mr. and Mrs. Fishwick's front lawn. <gasps> Mossy. She's done a poo! Look, children, I'll sort this out. You stay here. Poo bag, please, Tim. Here you go. Thank you. I'll be right back. Don't, don't worry about it. It's perfectly natural. <laughs> Hello, Mr. Fishwick. Ah! <laughs> oh, Mr. Fishwick, sorry about Mossy. Ah, oh, you're Mossy, <laughs> <laughs> go on, I'll... see you later. Go on, Mossy, go, go. Mr. Fishwick is always really kind to Mossy, isn't he? And that's when Tony said, I wonder what your new neighbours will be like. I wonder what your new neighbours will be like, Topsy and Tim. Like Mr. and Mrs. Fishwick, I hope. <laughs> me too. <laughs> Please. Excuse me, in we come. Come on in, Mossy. Excuse me. Thank you. There we go. Come on, Mossy. Let go of her topsy, sweetheart. Good girl. Come on, Mossy. There we go. Good girl. Mummy, will our new neighbours be just as kind to Mossy? Like Mr and Mrs Fishwick are? Yes, I should think so. Now, I need to wash my hands and then we can go for walkies. But I'm holding on to the lead this time. <laughs> <laughs> and that, said Mummy, was that. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Today, we looked after Grandma's dog, Mossy. But can you remember what Mossy took from the bathroom? Was it a toothbrush? Or was it a toilet roll? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is the toilet roll. Watch this. Good girl, Mossy. Stay. No, Mossy! Mossy, come back! No, Mossy! Uh-oh. Mum! Sometimes, when Mossy's a little bit naughty... Oh, Mossy, Mossy, you little scamp! We know it's definitely time for her walk. I'm going to have to throw this toilet roll away now. <coughs> Hurry up, please, Topsy, before Mossy does anything else silly. OK, Mummy! Great game! <laughs> that was good fun. See you soon! Run. Where's the last piece? Got it. Tony Welch and Vinda are coming to play. So we've got our marble run out. Hey, hey, quick, let's try it. But it isn't Tony or Vinda. It's Grandma and Mossy the dog. Hi, everyone, I've let myself in. No! Oh, Mossy! Oh. <laughs> Hello, where's my hello, Grandma, Huggle, Topsy and Tim? Come on. Whee! <laughs> hello, Jean. Oh, hi, Joy. I brought these over for the twins. Aww, these are the marbles your dad played with when he was young. I thought you could use them for your marble thingy. Thank you, Grandma. There's oh, loads. So good. There's a lot of marbles in there, but mm. this is called a marble room, Grandma. Oh, yes. The marble mm. goes in here. Yes. And all there mm. 
right. Around there. Yes. And comes out of there, there, there and there. Oh, I see. There's too many to count. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Did Mossy break it? Yes. Oh, you scamp. She did, but it's OK, Mossy. Good. We can rebuild it. Good, good, good. Right, come on, Mossy. You marble run masher. <laughs> Let's finish our walkies. Come on, girl. Bye bye. Bye, bye everyone. Bye, bye, Grandma. Thank you for the marbles. Bye, Jean. Bye, Grandma. Hello, Hello, Hello Elaine. Hi, Tony Welch. Yeah. Come in. Hi, Mrs. O'Dell. How are you? Fine. Tony's got a play date with Tim. Oh, they got the marble run out. Great. <laughs> oh, hi, Johnny. Can you help me? I'll drop the tape later, OK? Thanks, Joy. Have fun, Tony. <laughs> Bye. Oh, Topsy, Vinder will be here in a minute. OK. Hurry up, Vinder. This bit goes here. Yes. Can I put a piece on, please? Please, can I put a bit on? This bit goes here. Hmm. And this bit goes here. Oh, yeah. And these are Dad's old marbles. He played Let's with see. them as a kid. Let's see. Oh, Topsy Vinder's here. Yay! <laughs> Hi, Jazz. Hi, Vinder. I'll bring Vinder back about five. Is that OK? Come on, Vinder. Hi, Vinder. Hi. Hi. Can I play? Please. Let's make a marble one of our own. Shall we, Vinda? Yes, but how? Using all of this. We can make a marble one that's better than the boys. It's OK. Mummy! Please come use the cardboard recycling. Yes, just don't make a mess, you two. We're going upstairs, Tim. Come on. Tony is really good with the tricky bits of the marble run. I'll do this bit. Binder and I are using all of the old cardboard to make a long marble run of our own. Our marble run is going to be the best ever. Yeah. I'll tape it. Okay. There we are, all tapes. Where's the top bit? <sighs> there should be another one of these. Stairs. Where is the last piece? There's always one bit that has to go missing. Oh, I remember. I put it here so I wouldn't lose it. Oh, Tony. Now we can put it on to make a completed marble run. Yes! Okay, Topsy, now try rolling a marble down. Okay, but don't break our marble run. I don't even need to touch it. 
Mummy, can you help me? What do you need? I just need to pick this up and connect it to Topsy's marble run. Brilliant idea. Here we go, then. Oh, I see. We attach our marble run to their marble run. OK, let's pop This is going to be the best marble run ever. Careful, yeah, Topsy, there we go. I'll put the first <laughs> marble in. Can I use Dad's old marbles, please, Tim? Oh, yes. yes. Here you go, Topsy. Thank you. Really good teamwork, everyone. That's great. Ready? Yes. Now, Topsy. Three, two, one. Go, Marble! Go, go Marble! If the marbles are under the sofa, Tony. We've got lots more. Got it. And I found this. Is this a picture of your new house? No, because I don't want to move to a new house. Oh, well done, Tony. I've been looking for that all morning. Is it our new house? It might be. Who wants to see it? Me. Me. <laughs> and that's when Vinda said. It looks lovely. I'd love to live in a house like that. It looks lovely. I'd love to live in a house like that, Topsy and Tim. Wow, that's a big house. Yes, we can make a bigger marble run. Oh, good thinking, Tim. I'd I can't like wait. To move to a big house like that, and it's even got a red front door, see? That's right, it does. But now, I want to go on the marble run. And then it's my turn next. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the mummy. Was that? Hello. Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Can you remember what Grandma brought round for us today? Was it a bag of sweets? Or was it a bag of marbles? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is a bag of marbles. Watch this. Oh, hi, hi Joy. I brought these over for the twins. Aww, these you. are the marbles your dad played with when he was young. I thought you could use them for your marble thingy. Thank you, Grandma. That's oh, loads. So good. Great game. That was good fun. See you soon. Come on. <laughs> Car wash. Like, don't go getting messy. We won't. Mm -hmm. Bye. Bye bye. When Dad's in charge, it can mean only one thing. It's time for a dead rodeo. <laughs> Time. Now, what should we have for lunch? Sandwiches? Yes! yes. That's special sandwiches. Oh help. <laughs> and I'll tidy. Thanks, Topsy. Did 
you wash your hands properly, Dad? <laughs> yes, Tim, did you? Yes. <laughs> right. Where do we start? Making Dad special sandwiches is fun. One piece of bread. Thank you. Start with. Good boy. And then a slice of yummy cheese. <laughs> <laughs> OK. More bread, please. And then some of the yummy lettuce. Oh, and Dad's special ingredients. <gasps> Peanut butter. Mm. Finally, one more slice. And what do we do last? Cut it in three. Good boy. Ta da! Topsy! Topsy, we're having Dad's special sandwiches for lunch! Yummy! Coming! Oh. Cheese, peanut butter, and lettuce. Yum! Yum. Ready? Yep. Steady. No! Good job, you two. Thanks for lunch, Dad. What shall we do now? Well, since it's such a nice day, I'm going to wash the car. Yes! Yes! <laughs> Can we help wash the car, Dad? No, because you heard Mummy. She doesn't want you to get messy. You. We won't get messy if we're just watching. Yeah. Please, Tom, please. Dad splashes soapy water onto the car to get it clean. Washing the car is fun, but watching Dad wash the car isn't. Can we help you wash the car? Oh, no. Anyway, I'm nearly done. Topsy! <laughs> Boing! I'll get you for that. No! No, Topsy, no! I'm not going to get you! I'm going to get Dad! No! Uh, thank you, Topsy. I'll have that. Oh. OK, I give in. You can help me. You might get less messy if you do. <laughs> you can clean a wheel each. Yay! <laughs> Thanks, Dad. OK. There you go, Tim. I'll clean this wheel for you, Dad. Thank and I'll clean this wheel. Thank you. It's all soapy. It's all wet. Dad, come and see. This is really fun. Great work, twins. OK, now... I need, in this bucket, some clean, soapy water, please. OK. We'll get it. I'll put the soap in. You do the tap. OK. Wait for the water. We squeeze in the car shampoo. That's enough. A bit more, actually. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. And we add the water. Whoa. Come on, Tim. This is Dad. Hmm. Oh, hello, Mr. Fishwick. Hi, Fishwick. Mr. Fishwick. Hello, Topsy and Tim. Oh, look at you two. Hmm. We're helping Dad wash the car. Lucky Dad. <laughs> Bye, Mr. Fishwick. <laughs> you go, Dad. Oh, good. Now, let's finish this job and get <laughs> you two cleaned up before Mummy gets home. Dad, can I have a go, please? No, sorry. Oh. <laughs> 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 now, time for the really fun bit. Yay! <laughs> Tim, you got soap all over your hair. <laughs> Ready, set, move! <laughs> again, again, again! OK. Do it, Dad! Ready, set, move! Hello. Hello. <laughs> mm. 
Having fun? Yes! yes. We've, We've had so great fun! fun. <laughs> so much fun, Mum! <laughs> Messy fun! Sorry! Sorry. <laughs> oh, you're all wet! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Mummy told us to put on our dry clothes and then we should go out for a drive in the clean car. She said that she wanted to show us something. Where are we going, Mummy? What did you want to show us? I want to show you a house that's for sale on Westview Avenue. I've just been to see it. And that's when Dad said... Mummy, Mummy thinks, thinks it would be, be the perfect, perfect house for us to move to. Mummy thinks it would be the perfect house for us to move to. <laughs> so are we really moving to a new house? I don't want to. I like our house. Oh, don't worry, Tim. Maybe the house I found is nicer than this one. How does a bigger garden sound? Hmm? <laughs> or how about a bedroom of your own? And it's got its own drive for washing the car. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. No, it's raining on my clean car. <laughs> oh. Never mind. Should we go and see the new house in the rain? OK, gang? Yes! <laughs> Good. <laughs> and that, said Mummy, was that. Remembering. Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> today we helped Dad wash the car. But can you remember the colour of the car? Was it red? Or was it blue? The answer is behind the cloud. The answer is blue. Watch this. <laughs> <laughs> now, time for the really fun bit. Yay! <laughs> Tim, you got soap all over your hair. <laughs> Ready. Set. Fun. See you soon. <laughs> Bad smell. Mummy! Mummy! I made a butterfly mask! And I made a dinosaur mask! Rawr! Oh, wow, let me see! Oh my goodness, did you have fun at Carrie's then? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Can you help me find it? Today there's a bad smell in our house. And we don't know what it is. I can't breathe, Mummy. I'm going to hold my breath. Oh. <coughs> Poo! The smell is really strong under here. Is it the sofa? Is that where it's coming from? It's the sofa! Oh. Tim, look! It's that! I'm not touching it! Oh, what have you found? Oh. 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 It's Dad's sports bag! Well done, you two. Oh. oh, it's your Dad's dirty football kit. He must have left it in there for weeks. Oh, that oh. oh what's that smell? <laughs> Is your smelly football kit that you left behind the sofa? Sorry. Oh. Yeah. Oh. That'll be the estate agent. Who? The estate agent. Estate agents are people who sell houses, and hopefully this estate agent will sell our house. Why? 
Or so we can move to a bigger, better house. We're moving today? No, no, we're not. Anyway, our house is very smelly right now. And you can't sell a smelly house, Topsy and Tim. Go on. Mrs. O'Dell, Bert Burgess, Hatcham Estate Agent. Call me Joy. Thank you. Hello. Are you going to sell our house? Well, yes, I am. Are you the person who's going to show me around? Please, may I, Mummy? OK. I'm Topsy. Follow me. OK. Sorry, it's a bit smelly in oh, here. Oh, yeah. This is the kitchen, and this is my dad. Hello there, I'm Bert. Hi, Brian O'Dell. Nice to meet you. And this is Topsy's twin brother, Tim. Oh. Oh, I didn't expect to meet a dinosaur today. Well, it's a lovely kitchen. Mm. Uh, oh, what's that smell? It's that! <laughs> Ew! Oh, Brian, that smelly football kit needs to be in the washing machine, not on top of it. I'm sorry, Bert. The house doesn't normally smell like that. It's just that Brian left his dirty football kit in his bag for weeks. Oh, that's all right. I've done it. Smelly. <laughs> Would you like to come and see this armpit? Oh, I'd love to. This garden's getting too small for Tim and me. Yes, well, I have seen bigger. Well, that's one of the reasons why we need a bigger house, a bigger garden. Sure. You know, as you can see, we've totally outgrown this one. It's, uh... mm -hmm. mm. Back in a minute. Tim, you okay? I can smell that bad smell again. Can you? I don't want to move to a different house. <laughs> oh, you. It won't be as bad as you think. You'll get a bedroom of your own and a bigger garden. Hey, you could even get a swing each. You know, twin swings. Would you like that? Yeah. Dad? Yes. You know you said that an estate agent couldn't sell a smelly house? Yeah. Well, I've hidden your bag. I've hidden your bag under your bed so the estate agent can't sell our house. <laughs> Are you sorry? I'm sorry, Dad. Good boy. Ugh, is that that smell again? Pooh, eh? I think the drains might be looking at me. It's your smelly bag, isn't it, Bry? Is it up here? Bry? Yep, it's in our bedroom. What? Why? Tim hid it under the bed. He thought it might stop the estate agent selling the house. But he's very sorry. Me. I'll wash it right now. Thank you. <laughs> oh, Tim, that's all right. You don't usually do silly things like that, do you? And it's a big day today, isn't it? Yeah, selling a house that you've been happy with, well, it's a big change for all of you. Why don't we show Bert around the rest of the house together, Tim? OK, come on. All right, lead on, Topsy and Tim. Hey, guys, help me set the table. Grab your knives and forks. After the estate agent left, it was time for lunch. Mmm, sausages. Taste well, guys. <laughs> OK, OK. Help yourselves. Oh. Now, 
Mummy and Topsy, I made a promise to Tim today, when we move to a new house, it's got to have a bigger garden. So, there's room for twin swings. Twin swings! Mm. Actually, the house on Westview Avenue has a big garden. Perfect for twin swings. Wow! Mm. And that's what Mummy said. I, I think, think we, we should, should move there. there. I think we should move there. Me too. If we can have twin swings. <laughs> <laughs> May I have some juice, Mummy? Of course you can. Of course we can have twin swings. Can I? Yes, you can. Now, tuck in before it gets cold. And that's the Mummy. Was that? <laughs> <laughs> Remembering. Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> there was a bad smell coming from behind our sofa today. But can you remember what we found behind the sofa? Was it Dad's smelly sock? Or was it Dad's smelly sports bag? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is Dad's smelly sports bag. Watch this. <laughs> Poo! The smell is really strong under here. Is it the sofa? Is that where it's coming from? It's the sofa. Oh. The bad smell's coming from... Tim, look! It's wrapped! I'm not touching it! Oh, what have you found? Oh. Oh. It's Dad's sports bag! Well done, you two. Oh. oh, it's your Dad's dirty football kit. He must have left it in there for weeks. Oh, that's... Oh, oh what's that smell? <laughs> Is your smelly football kit that you left behind the sofa? Great game! That was good fun. See you soon! <laughs> Pet sitters. Hi, Kerry. Oh, Come on in, everybody. Hi, Joey. Hi, Topsy. Oh, hi. Hi, Kerry. Tim! Poppy and Bailey are here! Hi, Carrie, Hi, Tim! her mum, dad and brother Jaden are going away for a few days. So they've brought Carrie's guinea pigs to our house for us to look after them. Oh, they're so cute! They're called Poppy and Bailey. That one's called Bailey. Yeah. Yeah. So lovely. That one's called Poppy. Let's put Poppy in. Ready? Here we go. Whoa. I think Are Poppy's a bit nervous. Well, it's time for us to go. Oh, OK. Oh, Daddy. <gasps> Thank you for looking after Poppy and Bailey twins. <laughs> Give Poppy and Bailey their feed and lots of cuddles. Yeah. Oh, we will. <laughs> good. And the hutch is in the garden, so they'll be very happy sleeping out there, all right? <laughs> we won't forget to keep their hutch clean and cosy for them. Pets. Bye bye, Topsy and Tim. Bye, bye Kerry. Bye, Tim. Bye, Poppy and Bailey. <laughs> oh. Come on. Bye, Poppy. <laughs> bye, Bailey. We've got to go. Bye. 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 Enjoy your break. Have bye. a lovely bye. time. We'll yeah, he's bye. going into a house. <laughs> Mummy, can we hold them now, please? No, not just yet. You can later on once they've settled in. Because this house and you are all new to them. Okay, but it's lunchtime, so come on, double wash your hands. Let them settle in. Okay, <laughs> mummy. <laughs> After we've had our lunch, the guinea pigs are a bit more used to our house. Mummy lets us hold them for the first time. <laughs> I think go. I like Bailey. Good girl, hold her nice. There you we're go. All soft and snuggly, Bailey. Oh, oh you are holding Look a really her well, eyes. Topsy. Good girl. Please, may I hold Puppy now? Yes, Tim. 
Mummy says if we look after Poppy and Bailey nicely this weekend, we can have a pet of our own when we move. There we go. You There's ready? a man in our garden. Oh, yes, I nearly forgot. What? Let's pop Bailey back in and I'll explain. He's putting a sign up, Mummy. Yes, he's been sent from the estate agents. They're putting a sign up to say that our house is for sale. Why? Well, so that anyone looking for a house to buy can see it. Hello! Wave, Tim. <laughs> oh, he's going now. Bye-bye. Bye. <laughs> the door of the cage is open! Oh, no! Oh. Where's Poppy gone? I can't see Bailey anywhere. Um, we've lost them. <laughs> Mummy. Sorry, we haven't looked after them very well. Oh, I should have checked that the gate was shut. Come on, we'll find them. Okay. Might be under the sofa. Mommy? Have a look over there. Is it under here? Let's see. Bobby, Bailey! Bobby, Bailey! Where are you? Oh. Bobby, Bailey! Maybe they're by the toys. Oh, good idea. I'll have a look in the hall by the shoes and boots. OK. We search everywhere, all afternoon. But we can't find the guinea pigs. They're not upstairs, Tim. What are we going to do? Mummy, what if we never find Kerry's guinea pigs? We will. We just have to keep looking. Hmm. I know. Mr Fishwick keeps pet rabbits. He might know what to do. Oh, that's a brilliant idea, Tim. Okay. Thank you for helping us, Mr Fishwick. Uh, uh, Where are we? I think. Now, tell me again what happened, Topsy and Tim. Well, we were looking after Kerry's guinea pigs uh -huh. while she's away, but they got out of their run. And now we can't find them anywhere in the house. Mm. Not even in their own house. I <laughs> see. Escaped guinea pigs. Right. Well, we'd better get this sorted. <coughs> Mr Fishwick knows just what to do. If you're looking for a guinea pig, you've got to think like a guinea pig. <laughs> Why? <laughs> well, it's like this. Have you been calling for them in a loud voice? Yes, very loud. Ah, well, that's not the right thing to do. You imagine, if you're really small and you hear a lot of shouting, well, what would you do? Hide. Well done. And what would you feel? Hmm. Scared. That's right. So you wouldn't want to come out, would you? Now, what do you think would make you want to come out? I know food! Exactly. So where's the guinea pig's food, Topsy? That's it. Now then. Get that box out. There's a good girl. There it is. Can you manage? Now, if you, if you shake that, when they hear it, they'll think it's dinner time. Well done, Topsy. <laughs> That's the idea. That's it. Shake the guinea pig's food box again. That's very good. And no loud noises, though, Topsy. That's it. Shake the food box again. Now, Tim, no sudden movements. Just very quietly. And listen, listen.
think they like it in your handbag. Yes, you can. If we didn't see them before, then you might have brought them to the shops. Well done, Topsy and Tim. I think I You are top class pet sitters. You really are. Bailey and Poppy are very lucky. Thank you for your help, Mr. Fishwick. Thank you. That's my pleasure. Now we need to make sure we close the gate. Perfect. Thank you, Tim. You guinea pigs are very good at escaping and hiding. Mummy? Yes, Topsy? Please can we have a pet of our own when we move house? And that's when Mummy said. Yes, I, I think, think so. Yes, I think so, Topsy and Tim. You can have a pet when we move house because you are very caring and loving pet sitters. Hooray! We're getting our pets. We're getting our pets. We're getting our pets. We're getting our pets. We're getting our. And remember what Mr. Fishwick said: no loud noises. <laughs> and that's the mummy. Was that? Hello. Are you good at remembering? Can you remember what happened to us today? This is our top scene to a memory game. Let's play. <laughs> Poppy and Bailey escaped today. Can you remember where they were hiding? Were they under the sofa? Or were they in Mummy's handbag? The answer is behind the cloud. Look, the answer is Mummy's handbag. Watch this. Look, there's Poppy and Bailey. There they are. It's Poppy and Bailey. They want Mummy's handbag all along. Oh, my goodness. Come on, Poppy and Bailey. Great game. Good fun. See you soon.